Hello, strategists, generals and soldiers of the Second World War. Welcome back to Panzerkorps Gold and playing hardball. And the battle at the Maginot line, where we are to smash through the French shield of the Maginot line, the impregnable line, or the at least they think it is impregnable. However, we are smart enough not to go for it from the front, but rather from the back. So we have landed our Fallschirmjäger here in the northwest. They will take the city, then go to the fort, the third fort, which has already been strategically bombarded and lost a lot of its ammunition, which is good. And then we can bombard it a bit further. Um, these guys, well, I, I guess we have to slow down a bit, little bit, because otherwise we just get in massive fire. And these guys, you can go three, one, two, three. Well, it would have probably. Oh no, no, they know. It, it was a good decision, I think, because they know where we are. These guys can look for four, one, two, three, four, so they can see everything on the side of the river. And then I guess these guys, the tank just attacked us possibly because this is clear yeah they could have driven along the road and then attacked us there so but next turn actually we can put the tank here infantry is there and then one two three or like so we can attack these guys and then f maybe even for from two sides all right so that's good here we have a little bit less progress. I mean, we could also, we could have rather co rather concentrated all our forces on Metz, taking out this area and then switching to the sides like this. But I'd rather encircle them like this. Because otherwise it will be a pain if we have only a few troops on the periphery. So I guess it's fine, so. And then, ah oh yeah, and here these guys, well you are, you are just regular Wehrmacht, so we are not attacking this minefield, I guess, but we will use the pioneers. They can clear the mines, although they always lose, it appears they, uh, I think they lose the, um, always one. But we'll see. That's as far as much as I know from the game. <coughs> so and over here, yeah, things are also rather stabilized. So the massive railroad artillery will give defensive fire to these guys. So I guess no one will dare to attack us. And here it's also fine. All right then, so I guess we can progress to the next turn. We are not attacking anybody there yet. Weather looks good. So let's progress higher there. Oh! Ah! Okay, that's not good. We are under fire over here. Where was it there? Okay, oh. One, two, three. So these guys. So let's go there. You guys go into the city, clear the mines. Well, I'm just decreasing the volume a bit, so it's a bit loud. Here, you shoot this infantry, very good. You guys get rid of them. In the city of Bouzonville, but we stay here. Yeah, and then these guys can actually march up. Uh, well, I guess we can probably just ignore this minefield here. Huh? Let's go here and then we can make... Ah, no, we have to take this one, right? Or oh, these guys. No, they shouldn't go onto the bridge just like that.
So I guess... I guess... I guess it's possible... Where was it? Where did they shoot? From there, right? No, or from here? No, huh? Where was it? Ah, uh, here, up there. So there's another artillery bunker. Artillery fortification over there. Well, it will, it will take my way too long to go around with this infantry to strengthen their position. So I guess they will just fall back and wait uh, for the assault from this side. Ah, they are on this side, all right. Ah, it's a bit sad. Well then, let's go. Let's go here, so we see a target. Ah, yeah. Ah, another minefield. Uh, I didn't want to waste the artillery shot. <coughs> and the next one, they can shoot. And they take this one. And after that, they can go there again. We need to shoot the this fortification anyway. So you guys, you just stay in the forest. Just preventing any attacks on our flank. So here. Doesn't look like anybody's coming from here at this point. You guys go there, you get a shot first. Very good. Getting target information from the recon. Yes, you take them out. Very good. Yeah, we've got enough artillery over here, so you guys. Help out on, on the right. Like so, huh? Then... And you shoot them. Ooh, that is a nasty one. Well, then you guys can take them out. Oh, a lot of cavalry. Ah, no more movement there. So you guys have four. Maybe we, maybe we have one more air attack on them. You guys. Shoot. Maybe we use you guys as recon. I'm always a bit afraid of the flak, but on the other hand, we need to get going. Uh. There might be flag over here as well, so I mean they they I think they had some here, right? And also it's like the default, the standard procedure to have anti-air on the airfield. So question is if there's anything here. <coughs> so let us just fly there. The daring ah yeah. Daring flight over enemy lines. Okay, th so, well, and I think they could probably muster and ready their weapons like all around these spots, right? So we are ne nowhere really safe. Uh, but I guess it's fine. So you guys shoot yourself some tanks. Let us maybe have one shot at these guys. Yeah, these guys can help up there. You. Guard the bunker. This is probably
probably the command. Oh, that was ineffective, okay. So my impression is that actually that it's better to fly up. And then, then bomb, because then also it's kind of a surprise, right? So here we need to set up. Oh, I guess I have falsch mir Going there. And then these guys, they have range 3. 1, 2, 3. Then we are out of the... Ah. Ah, there's no one here, alright. Easy picking. Could sh start shooting them. So let's have you guys shoot. Ah, oh yeah, and then we can recon this whole area. Get some tanks. Ah, oh yeah, there they are, alright. You guys go here, bomb them. To not much effect, you go forward, but there. Ah, oh yeah, you could really take them out easily, or easily enough. Yeah, let's throw them out of the town. Ah, oh yeah, more tanks, okay. Nice, nice shooting. Maybe we can draw these guys into the town, which would be nice. So, okay, so there. Uh, we can't go near there. Well, that would actually be really good uh, to draw the tanks out. That's the Hotchkiss. It's even the Hotchkiss. These other guys, the Renault, yeah, the, you are the slower one. Albeit rather nicely armored. Hotchkiss, okay, so. I want to get rid of all of these. And actually rather... I oh know we can't go there anyway and attack the bunker this turn. So it doesn't really matter so much. Yeah, so let's attack these guys here. Nice. Yeah, yet. let's use these guys. From here, we are not in danger of being attacked anywhere. Oh, come on! Then you guys drive here into the open. They, they should be reasonably safe. Oh, no. Ah, we do have a strategic bomber over here. So let's fly it over there, all right. Nothing else to support it. Ammunition seven. I wonder if this thing gives defensive fire. So what else can we do in the air, you guys? are excellent for shooting tanks. We can't attack these guys. However, these are our, our nice target. They are even at strength 5, 1, 2, 3, 4. They could attack us there. So let's reduce them. I doubt they have anti-air here in the swamp. Yeah, and we are not attacking the bunker because it can shoot back. So let's do it like this to reduce their offensive capabilities. You guys could drive there. Yeah, to defend our artillery here and then the infantry goes here, artillery goes there, attacks them. And you guys go here and also, or rather, yeah, 
Oh no, we can't go there because uh, this artillery will otherwise shoot us. And these guys, well, they could attack us. Yeah, well. Let's provide support. You guys go there. You shoot there. Very good. Yeah, well, we are locked a little bit. Very good. Oh, they are not fleeing, all right. Can we follow up with the plane? Maybe, although I would have rather shot some cavalry over here. These guys have entrenchment one. Oh, let's rather do this. So we don't have any abilities, hopefully. Okay, good. That's very good. Very good. So now, well, the infantry... No, they can't go onto the mountain or this hill. Very good. Very good. So you guys... But they could go one, two, three here. Uh, so our artillery can stay on this side of the river. Just bombard the bunker over there. And I guess you guys, you just resupply. And the next turn they can go here, shoot the artillery, neutralize it for this turn, and then these guys can go in. Would be nice to have some artillery support though. I guess we'll have an attack here with this infantry. Okay, we're not attacking there. You guys can't do anything. So you grab the town. Right? Yeah. Just grab the town. That is fine. Nothing else to do up here. Yeah, we're not taking the town yet. Go here and provide uh, 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 cover. Although we are really vulnerable now, so if someone is here, but that's just a risk we have to take at the moment. And I have reasonable doubts that they could do it, but then they are also isolated. And then we just drive this, these guys, or actually, oh no, they can't. Eh? Yeah. Very sad. We can't drive here. Otherwise, I would have just driven there so they could give a uh, defensive fire to each other. All right, so. But that's fine. Let's hope it wasn't a mistake, though. You guys. Oh, yeah, we, we haven't used you. Okay. Why haven't we used you? Because it's very dangerous to go around. Uh, but I guess... Like here, they shouldn't be able to reach us. One, two... Uh, it's even the slow one. One, two, three either, or one, two... And then he shouldn't be able to get into the forest.
maybe these guys have a range of five. One, two, three, four, yeah. So I guess you can just go there and shoot the bunker. And then you guys just stay here and we resupply you. Because we're not going near this thing right now. It's also, it has very high stats. It's very good at shooting. Us dead, so maybe we actually destroy. No, 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 no. We are we are concentrating on this bunker first up there, because otherwise it, it it's it would be totally stupid. So I guess we would have to suck up the fire, but we have to wait for the these guys anyway. So let's go here. Just go here, resupply them, you guys. Don't need much anyway, but it's fine, I hope. You are not shooting, just blocking. You are fine, everyone is fine. Yep, that's it. So let's see how they react. Oh no, oh my goodness, four dead. That was a nasty shot. Yep. And now anybody, anybody who had doubts about uh, the question if it's wise or not, and this is even super overstrength, this thing. The Ford full came on, uh, knows why we have to keep a distance. Return to the airfield. It's the situation here. Now they have one more shot. So where's the other strategic bomber? We fly there. By the way, I just wanted to see, do they resupply? Yes, they do. Okay. Nice. Nice bombing. So actually... No, no, we need to take the town so we don't have anybody in our bag. Yeah, and they are just staying put. So we just... How much ammunition do we have? Five. For one more turn. We're just staying put. And then we can also... Yeah, we just resupply these guys. You guys are fine, or you could now actually attack them and we are out of range of these guys. Yeah, well, let's do it like that. Let's destroy this fortification first. Oh. Okay, you shoot some more tanks. Return to the airfield. You guys are regular Gebirgsjäger, but you are not going near this bunker. Just taking the town. It's a bit sad about these pioneers. Maybe we, yeah, we, we will use the pioneers go around and then in one turn we can go from there. And if these guys go into the city, we can uh, attack the city again. Very nice. So these guys, they pulled some infantry into the city, which is good. So we can guard them. Very nice. Oh, nine. Okay, all right. If we go here, no one can shoot us. One, two, three, yep, very good. Ah, oh, it was five, okay. It's 
So you guys go there. And then oh, that was bad. Well, very good. Rather high losses, so we keep this town open. But, uh, no, and no cover fire. Okay, now. Let's shoot them some more. Oh, that was a good one. But they are not suppressed, so let us clear this minefield. And first take this one. And then we'll return next turn. I don't want to have any losses. You guys sneak up. Ah, yeah. The Zaha River. All right then, and so the air. You guys, oh, you can destroy the tank if you're lucky. I think a fighter should do it. You guys fly there. Very good. Now we can relax a little bit. And they have this and that tank left. Alright, you guys. Oh, you they are out of range. Oops, sorry. Uh, do we have any further plans? Oh, no. Just this one. Right out of range, very sad. Can't go there. So let's actually reduce this one. Or maybe it's not necessary actually. If you go here, shoot them. They have entrenchment three. Ah, uh, the tank shouldn't go into the forest. Hmm. So we could attack them by air, but then it's not certain that we um, uh, yeah, cause any suppression or loss. Uh, it's also not certain if the tank will push them away first. So maybe it's be the best to just destroy these guys by air and then we'll see how far we go. But it would be nice to push these guys out in the open and then our infantry could go on this field and finish the uh, the bunker off. Or oh, they have uh, only strength three anyway, so yeah, let's Oh no, come on. Yeah, these things are really strong. So you push them, you can't push them. Yeah, bad. Let's go here, very bad. Oh. Yeah. Not a good situation over here. You guys, oh no, you are not attacking them in the forest, so you guys have to go there. Losses. Oh, they can't even go there, but you could finish off the, the bunker though, so let's do that. They are defenseless. Very good. Very good indeed. If you go there, take it. Take the position. The fortification. Without number. Uh, oh well, the, the thing had a number. But I don't remember it. So, we have to fake something in our report, right? So I guess it's no use going around here. So you guys are driving there and then next turn you can just uh, you kill off these guys, these, these fortifications from here. Well, there's no one here to oppose us. They're just sitting in their bunkers. 
So we drive the tank here. Yeah, and then here. And you can either go there and then shoot these guys. They will not be able to come here. In, if someone is exactly on this tile, it's one, two, three, four, five. Well, okay. If there's a tank or a cavalry unit exactly there, it's not good for us, but I guess they would have attacked already, right? And then also the, the 280 millimeter K5 will provide cover fire for these guys too, so I guess we are fine. <coughs> Now, they, the artillery can shoot like so. Yeah, we, so we are keeping this position. Just shooting again for, for good measure. But you are not able to wipe them out. Although they will probably flee. Yeah them some more. So, yeah, I, I hope it's not getting too static. Oh, come on. Now, yeah, well, that was a bad shot. That's what prevented us from destroying them. But the tank needs to get out of there. Yeah, bad. Bad shooting. And now you guys, well, you could possibly destroy them. So let's try it. The mountain, well, I should have probably attacked them over there. So you guys just go there. You could of course destroy them, but then we get a shot from two artilleries. That is rather suicidal, so we are not doing it. You guys just resupply, or maybe we could even... No, sorry. We don't have any... Well, we do have men, but uh, we have to do it like this. So... Anything we could do here? Well, we are not risking our guys like that. We are not getting into the artillery fire and not into the fire from this bunker. So yeah, it's very sad. We can't really follow up. The only good news is that these guys hopefully will not have such big trouble with these fortifications despite their strength uh, against infantry. And we need to follow up uh, with with planes. So, all right. So that's this turn. You guys, yeah, you are not going into any artillery fire yet, at least. This is all fine. You guys can resupply. You guys. Just entrench yourself. Let these guys sh keep shooting. It's a bit sad, but uh, they will. They will. Uh, it's, it will be their turn soon as well. And by the way, if this one is, it could probably. It looks like no. It's, I think the, these guys. <coughs> they can only uh, drive there and not here. 
But from here it would be one, two, three, four. Then we could shoot them. Yeah. Oh yeah, so there's actually, there is no, uh, or oh, there is a connection actually, if we, if we kill off this, t uh, this fortification, this one can drive around, like all around here. Oh, that's actually pretty good. And then with the railroad, uh, we can actually start shooting at Mets. So maybe we uh, really keep, uh, keep Mets surrounded but stay out of uh, out of range of them <coughs> um, and then we start start shooting at their uh, at them with the rail with the railroad we just need to get rid of this here then we are really flexible actually all right then we just have to make sure that we take this here, so we we have uh, we don't have uh, anyone anybody in our bag. All right then, so that's good. Anybody to resupply? No, no, no. You guys are all fine. Stay in position. And just to make sure that really no one can attack us, you guys don't get through. You guys, one, well, you could get there. So you go here and provide cover fire for, for this artillery. Here, everything is fairly safe. No one can actually go around. Well, the, the char could be in trouble with this cavalry, but they they are rather weak against hard targets, so I guess it's not a problem. Next turn we will uh, pound these guys a little bit. Oh yeah, and our grenadiers are in range to take this fortification. That is pretty sweet. And this yeah, all right, so that's it, so. Oh no, oh yeah, okay, it's just cloudy. Hopefully there's no more rain, so all right. Good, they are in trenches, oh no. All right, well, it's far enough away. So you guys bombing them. What's the situation? Ah, yeah, nice. They only have one ammunition left. That's actually pretty good. <coughs> so, actually, now it's time. So, press 9. That's That looks very good. Yeah, and we are not going there. So let's go here, you guys, it's just, ah, we need to do something about the artillery over here, of course. But they are suppressed. So you guys take out these. Oh, that was unnecessary. You get into the trenches, or maybe, maybe actually, let's just wait a moment. You guys drive there. You go here, attack them, but maybe we get one plane around first. So what are you? You are a Junker, so actually... Well, having you on these guys is possibly better, but where's our tactical bomber there? Now you are a little bit far off. Oh no, you are too far away. That was not good. So we only have, oh, we have nothing here. All right, so it's going to be you. Looks like the tanks are getting away, but it's 
worth it. We can get rid of this thing as quickly as possible. So you... Or you could follow up. Oh, come on. That was really bad. Oh, but on the other hand, now you can destroy them. Very good. So that was actually good. <coughs> good combination. And now... Yeah. Oh, there's another minefield here. All right. So you guys... Attack this one. Very good. And they have one more shot, actually. Uh, I would have thought they would shoot, shoot back because it was not suppressed completely, but whatever. So then from here... Yeah, well then you guys get in there. You are Gebirgsjäger. Yeah, we need to control these tanks. So I guess the Gebirgsjäger go here and these guys go into the city. And these guys have five, two, four, or one. No, no. So go, good. So you guys go there for the moment, the long legs. And then you... to no effect all right but now no five are suppressed okay then so and we have a strategic bomber over here which we can use against these guys they have 16 Or like there well let's let's do something up here first by the way oh no yeah they can only drive there so this bunker use the pioneers getting into town destroying the bunker oh come on you guys can't do much Well, let's block this one. Oh! More minefields. You keep pounding. Oops, sorry. So we retreat a little bit. Oh yeah, and you destroy the minefield. Just so that it's gone. And the next turn we can go from here and attack the bunker. And they are all but surrounded. So down here. Things are also progressing nicely. Here we have more air support. And you guys just circle over the bunker. Yeah, you guys can resupply. You entrench. Just keep them occupied. Let them shoot at you, but not shoot you. You also need to keep or stay in position. So here we've got a strong you. Yeah, and I guess now it's time for these guys to fall. Twelve 
and elite cavalry, apparently. Although they are not experienced at all, just over strength. So, lots of horses. destroy the uh, cavalry first and then but it's kind of a waste just to shoot one um you go there shoot them oh they are not good oh they are usually excellent against soft targets well that was a really bad shot i guess Yeah, so we can do a strategic bombardment up here. Oh no, come on. We are out of range. Just one tile. Oh well. So then... Did, can they actually shoot anybody anyway? No. They are not dangerous at, anymore uh, the, during this turn. So we can rather bombard these guys. Oh yeah, there's more infantry there. Hmm. Alright, but it looks okay. So, you guys need to return to your airfield. who got away yeah well that's just a waste so you can you do anything useful that is not dangerous only the cavalry down there I guess Let's shoot the cavalry. And now the tactical bomber might be able to destroy these guys. No, they are not, because they are also in the uh, in the hills. Well then. You guys drive there. They will run away and then the char can follow up. And there, killing them off the map. You guys drive here. Finish off the cavalry. And then. Yeah, we are not attacking them this turn. S a slight waste. I know, but we are not wasting our men. And also no planes. However, oh, there is entrenchment here. Uh, So we need to we need to scout ahead around here. Yeah, so oh you guys well then let's resupply. You guys also are down to eight uh, to three. Then you guys have plenty of fuel left. Let us Yeah, then, then we just harass these guys. Oh, nice. But we're not getting in there, just to finish them off. One, two, three. Yeah, 
We could though. Could go in with one infant uh, with one yeah with one artillery. One, two, three. So you guys if you go here or rather you are normal Wehrmacht. Let's go here and we can use one artillery and the other one will provide cover fire anyway. So we'll go here. You guys. You guys have one more shot. You go here and you take them out. Very nice. So one there's infantry around. You guys get resupplied. It's a little bit too static, but uh, of course they are entrenched like crazy over there. And we are not going to throw the lives of our men away. That's our responsibility. And actually we can shoot those who could actually do something. All right, that's that. Are the infantry yeah no they needed to go here because the these guys were there on the hills all right and then we have uh, more strategic bombers and you guys <coughs> oh actually we could attack them come on let's do it very nice if only, oh, the pioneers. Oh, they weren't ready yet. I wanted to have them here, right? But anyway, so that was actually, I think, good opportunity. Uh, and I want to, so the pioneers come too late. They are just too late. But that was a good opportunity to take out four of the five bunkers over here. Um, all right, so then what else? You guys can just stay put. You are no engineers and you are just, you're not running into any minefields. But actually, can you go somewhere else? No. Oh no, it was just coincidence that we found it, right? Or did we? Yeah, because I wanted to protect the artillery. All right. But good to know that there's no, no one, n none here. So these guys can go there and attack them, destroy them. And you guys just go in and take the fortification. Yeah. Next turn. All right, so. Going here. Now they are just being blocked over there. You guys. Well, we don't know what's going on here, so that's it makes me very suspicious. Uh, there could be a lot of units actually down there. But we'll see probably next turn when our uh, surveillance or the, our recon <coughs> can drive a little bit into that direction. So let's see. You guys are fine. So anybody to uh, to resupply? No. Okay. <clears throat> That's fine. Oh, you guys. Fly back to the airfield. It's more flexible. And I guess with the next run we attack there. But these guys, they are, they only have one shot left. And after that, they are defenseless. So I guess they are not even shooting. I hope for our artillery, because I guess that's the prime target for them. All right, then. So next turn. Yes. Oh, my. Uh, well. One. Very good. Very good indeed. So, and now we finish them off. That's what they deserve. At Longuillon. 
Very good. Fallschirmjäger going in. Longuillon is ours. Oh, there are even more mines over around there. Uh, you guys. You go here. Oh, it's actually, let's wait a second. Here we have the recon flight. You can go here or bomb those guys. And there's only one left. So maybe we rather use you. They, they are able to destroy them, right? So we are rather using you on this one and then the other strategic bomber uh, which is here. So let's rather use you over there. And then the you. Yeah, in one of these bunkers, I guess. Yeah. Can you reach these guys? Yes, you can. Very good. So let's destroy some tanks. Oh, that's good. Oh yeah, Iron Cross first class, very nice. Helmut Lent, attack one, initiative six. So the tanks can finish them off. Very good. Yeah, let's use the strategic bomber over there because Well, let's destroy this one first. Don't even take casualties into the fortification. Very nice. Oh, more mines over here, so. There are not many pioneers left to defend, or to, uh, to get rid of the minefield for of all the mines. So you guys. Yeah, we are bombing this one strategically. Oh, but to not much effect actually. Let's bomb first, so like this. And then pioneers can go here completely suppressed very good they might be surrender no they are not surrendering right no I wonder what the conditions are but our long legs oh no that's Gebirgsjäger but you can go here and finish off uh, the bunker They are totally terrified. Our guys can also use the experience. Yeah, and then we just take the, the recon. Or maybe actually we, we can take a look what's going on there by bombing these guys. Good. Okay, just infantry. More infantry. Yeah, we are driving in here, saving the time. But we are not attacking them. But they are all but isolated. Right here. Shoot this one. Also to keep our casualties down. You attack them. 
But that was uh, the wrong uh, uh, the wrong move. Actually, I wanted these guys to attack, but whatever. But actually, this is uh, better because now you can go in here, uh, and next turn we can already attack this bunker with the pioneers. Very nice, actually. Now you attack this bunker. You guys take a great risk. They have entrenchment eight. Hopefully, just orders to stay put. Guys, the bunker. Very good. And now you're out of ammunition. Not a good situation to stand up on the hill. But hopefully they don't. Yeah, they only have the, the infantry that will not leave their positions because they are also afraid. So here, you guys can actually attack this one. Very nice. Six suppressed. Let's follow up with one. It's one more shot. Oh, that was bad. We even knew where they are, so... Hmm. Okay. I hope they are not shooting anybody down. Yeah, well, looks like we have to follow up. We've used the strategic bombers, but it looks it looks okay. So, so let's. Losing all planes, not good. Oh come on! But now you guys move in. Uh, well, and now we can actually take a look what's going on. So this position is Sarreburg is also ours. Drive there. Oh, yeah. So Muas and these guys. All right. So we fall back. And the Somua. One, two, three, four, five. Four, one, two, three. <gasps> and then they could possibly, I'm not sure if this takes two. Yeah, I think so. They could attack these guys, but they are an entrenchment. So, and you, you have sufficient of everything. And <coughs> let's bring you in a flanking position. Let's bring you guys if you are there. That doesn't make a difference actually. So let's stay put for the moment. And the next turn, or the turn after next turn, when we start pounding these guys to get the city of Saverne, they can also make a. Oh, actually, no. They can go here and then they can move into the city when we when we took out these guys but only after next turn i guess we need to shoot them before that oh they could have been flexible to drive there or something and then shoot but they are out of ammunition so what i would li really like is an artillery like the sturmpanzer but uh, with more ammunition So we can follow up easier. So that's all uh, a little bit sad actually. So you keep shooting those guys, very nice. They are nearly done. You guys get resupplied. You 
shoot them. You shoot them. Would be good to follow up, but we are not getting into the 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 fire again. So you guys, yeah, we just need one shot over here, and then you can get g working, start working on the fortifications. I think this will be the job of this artillery. They will just move back one, shoot them. Oh no, they can't move back because of these guys. Who need to resupply. Oh, we blocked ourselves a little bit over here. All right, so <coughs> you guys are the blocking force. Yeah, we don't have anybody left to block, to move, or to be resupplied. You are not attacking them. Ah, we do have some planes left. All right, so I forgot about the plane. So that is fine. Any infantry to shoot. Can follow up on these guys. Yeah, we're not getting close to the town, although here they should also be safe. But let us. Yeah, let us shoot them. Also, they are in the open. Nice. with this plane but you guys yeah need to get back to the airport right that's right there right then so but that's it no there was someone who could be resupplied okay you guys have ammunition for that's fine so maybe we should reduce their ideas of getting on the offensive some further, these guys will work on, on this one first. Yeah, so that spot is the tank. Oh, come on. That's that. Yeah, so, and as time has progressed, how things will commence further, we will see in the next episode. I hope you found this one cool. We have, well, we have broken through the Maginot line. <coughs> we have several bridges through it. We have more or less isolated the wider area of Metz. And we have take to take care of the right flank. But that's fine, I guess. So how things will d uh, develop further, we'll see in the next episode. Please click the like button and you're very welcome to join the channel as well. So you never ever miss one of the wonderful videos at Playing Hardballs again. See you next time. Bye bye. Cheers.